today I shall mostly be fitting and trying out my new seat. Okay, so this is my new seat, Donna Gel Flow, Cella Italia. The same make as this one. So it is ultimately already squishier than this seat here that is like rock. And maybe if I had tried the, with this one for a bit longer, it, you know, it will supple up. But it's just like, I, could, I can't, I need to be on a bike that I'm comfortable on the seat. So anyway, we don't know if this one's going to be the one, but pff, we'll give it a go. A little bit of chilled music to tackle a mechanical chore. Some of you will have seen what happened with the um, tyre changing incident. Okay. That was quite loose. <laughs> I'm not even sure which is off and which is on here. I do not want to lose my little bit. Oh my god, now they're both coming out. We need to get that off as well. I've got the little um, thing on holder for my toolkit. Of course, I can't remember I've already got this on there now. Uh. <laughs> oh my god, we're failing at the first hurdle already. Because we can't quite get this bloody widget out of here. I can't remember how I've got this in here. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Let's try putting it on the right way around, you moron. Oh, now then. I'll have to look in the photos to see which was front and which was back. So somewhere in my photos, ages ago, I took a picture of my bike seat on the previous bike because then I know I can look at the measurements and know roughly a starting point for where I need the seat to be. And also it's going to show me which is front and which is back. So that's... That's the front and that's the back. Love can you feel it too? I can feel it all. So in case you didn't clock it when you took this off your bike, or you maybe don't have a seat on your bike at all. So the little bit, I mean, these are all different, but let's take it out. This little bit. Get that into the bars, sat, before you put the seat on. You see on the stop signs, I'm going to put it about up the front. Okay, so here, we've got a groove in the middle, so the piece of this is going to fit in the groove. On mine, the longer bits go at the back, the shorter bit at the front. And the little thing just sits in the cups. And hopefully you can see through to get your little bolts in. make it equally tricky you've got these little bits that fit into the top bit and you're screwing up through the bottom bit and trying to get it into this moving object that's floating around in the top section that you put that you put on first so that adds fun and games to the job also of course these things move around and the whole point is is that you can change the angle of your seat as well as moving it back and forth and up and down so It can be a bit fiddly getting these in at first and you do not want to bloody misthread it. 
but just get it started now I think that because I've put this first one on and I've really tightened it up obviously you can see the seat Whoa, it's like this so you need to like juggle it around a bit so I probably need to loosen this off a bit that's tightening try and sit the seat oh, I'm still I'm just going to screw this one down first before this let me see that. <laughs> God. right now stop jiggling about you want it down at the back more I suppose screw this one up a bit more okay let's have a little go on that okay not ideal but so when my um I think this is right I don't know but when my pedal see I can see it in the camera my knee is not over my toe so I suppose that's a good position right there as far as seat height so I'm putting the pedals what's that that's like 10 to 5 I suppose that is 10 to 5 and you put your heel on the lowest pedal just try just try to lift your body off the seat and if it only just that's about right for me now so this should be good already I can tell this is uh, well hopefully this is a more comfy seat it feels very different the other thing I found is that it's knowing where you're supposed to sit on the saddle and I know that sounds stupid it might sound stupid but you know so you sit you're supposed to sit up the saddle for going uphill up the front well I don't really like that it seems to f it feels like it's restricting my pedaling when you back everyone's backsides are different how do you know like is it supposed to be right at the back i suppose my sitting bones are right on the gel pads there so maybe that's where it's supposed to be still feels like it's a little bit i might tip it back a little bit can only bloody just get on there okay take two Well, I guess the only way to know is to actually go out and ride on it. All I've got to do is do something to eat and then go and get the blooming kids. And then I can go out. I really hope that this seat is the answer. There's no way you can ride for prolonged amounts of time on a really uncomfortable seat. Just, I've tried it. I have tried it. I've given it a damn good go. <laughs> I don't advise it.